21st century, I think we're living in the century of networks. All of our devices, our gadgets are networked somehow. We all live in networks. And I think that's a way of looking at how things evolve, even in society. I do networks, this is what I do. I'm here at Masters of Networks to understand more about networks and communities and really try to define them both from a qualitative way, which is more my background as a community manager and as a UX designer, and also being able to work with data scientists. My personal interest is in developing tools that can look at the networks of how crowds interact and automatically detect those things when things are going well or poorly and where you may want to intervene. I'm here at Master of Networks to exchange my experience in community of practice and social network with other community managers. The idea of bringing together people like me, network scientists, data crunchers, with those that really deal with you know, communities of people exchanging information, discussing. I'm here because I'm interested in the patterns of collaboration across different people in online communities. I think online communities are potentially very important because they are our best shot at getting participatory democracy really working on a large scale. I came to Masters of Networks to try to understand how the network of edge riders looks like in a, in a graph. Thinking in networks is about thinking in systems, and networks, especially networks of people, are very complex systems. That There's something about them that's more than the sum of their parts. It makes you think about the emergent patterns of how people influence each other and how those influences spread. So thinking in networks is focusing attention and to uh, collective efforts, relationships, rather than individuals. Wikitalia developed EdgeSense to help online community managers look at their communities as social networks of people interacting with each other. With it, you can see network dynamics in real time, just as they happen. For example, you can see sub-communities forming, detect islands of people who are completely disconnected from the broader community or identify participants who are central in the conversation. I try to use the EdgeSense installation of our database, look at what relationships are being formed between community members, what sub-communities are, are existing now and what is the role of us moderators in that conversation. Thinking in networks means taking a step back and being a little more humble and thinking about things that happen as an emergent property of your interaction with you know, other people as opposed to some kind of heroic enterprise done by some kind of charismatic leader. I feel to belong to a community. I think they are very useful in terms of promoting the idea that we are part of a bigger movement and there is no one institution, one actor in the society or one single resource that we can approach. I think the idea is that if we work together, networks are a great, great tool for collaboration. Yeah.